Well, I'm from West Virginia. I uh, got a lot of experience, you know, with West or with the the old West Virginia Conference. You know, the Mountain East Conference. Know the teams very well. Played in the league at Glenville State and Fairmont State. Coached at Concord, um, and had spent ten years, you know, at California University of Pennsylvania, which is about forty some miles down the road. So um, being in an area that I knew really well, you know, from a recruiting standpoint, was important. Being at a school, you know, that was committed to football was important. And then, uh, you know, knowing, knowing Roger and the staff as well as I did, and uh, I thought it was a good fit. It made some sense. And uh, West Liberty made, you know, checked all the boxes, so to speak. And uh, not that that's the reason why it worked out, but, you know, just it just felt right. That's because we're old guys now. You know, we, we, we were both young coordinators in this league, you know, at one time. Um, I was at Fairmont State as a young coordinator, and obviously he was here at West Liberty as a young coordinator. And we played a similar style, you know, so... Uh, over the years, you know, when I became a head coach in this league, I uh, got to know him pretty well. You know, we, we did all the league meetings together and, and uh, you know, came up here and golfed with him a couple times. And uh, good, you know, been very good friends. Philosophically, we see the game, you know, the same way, um, which to me was very important, you know, and uh, this guy I could trust, you know, a guy who I know is going to do things the right way. So all that was critical. Well, I think you got to see football the same way, you know, um, the way that I see football, the way that I was raised, is it was it's basically a numbers game. You know, you got to have balance within your offense. You got to be able to throw the ball. You got to be able to run the ball. You got to be able to throw it to different people. You got to be able to get the ball in the run game to multiple people. You can't. You've got to play situational football. You can't be stat driven. Um, I think that's critical. It's a good way to you know to lose. I've been coaching 20 some years and been fortunate enough to have most of the time, you know, a lot of winning seasons, seven conference championships, final fours, all those things. It's kind of funny. I never got into this thinking, you know, that I would be a head coach someday. Um, just wanted to coach the quarterback to start out as, and then, then eventually got to be, well, I think I can run the offense. And if you do that, then, you know, it's just a natural progression of things. You're going to be a head coach. When I go to Concord and you're the head coach and the coordinator and the quarterback coach, that's one of the first times where I realized, like, this could get away from you. That's a lot of hats to wear. I mean, it is what it is. It's, it's, it's part of, of being a, a guy. I think, I think in Roger's case, having a guy like me on staff who, you know, he could lean on. There's already been a couple times with discussions where, you know, I, I saw which direction he was going in because I've been in those shoes. You, you know, you want to win. You want to do well. I want to, you know, I, I just want to come in and coach football and make the players better. You know, I think if I do that, then, then you'll you'll find the you'll get the player support. You know, as long as you're working at it, and and because you're not going to please everybody, you got to go be you, and uh, you're not going to please all the players. It's inevitable. But if I think if you're working at it, you know, and your players are, are playing hard, and you're making them better, then then it's going to work out. But I mean, I you know I want to come in going to feed and win the net. I mean, all, all those are your goals. But uh, you know how realistic that is. Right now, it'd be it'd be silly to say that. You know, I just want to come in. and Put in a good, you know, put in a good system and 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 clean up what we're doing and and uh, you know get the kids playing a certain you know style of football, a certain standard of football, and uh, and help this staff get reach all the goals that we want to reach.